The infomercial is all over the place. Chances are you've seen it. Truth is, though, it almost looks too good to be true. So we went into the kitchen to test out the Magic Bullet Platinum Pro. It kind of looks like a blender, but it's smaller and upside down. They call it the Magic Bullet Platinum Pro. Most of you have seen the ad. Three second thing, one, two, three, and he's done. You say, oh yeah, right. You know, that's, what, that's, that's what my impression usually is. I'm, I'm very skeptical. Right? That's Alberto Diaz from Granados in Salt Lake. You've probably caught him on Fox 13's Live at 11. When it comes to blenders and food processors, he knows them inside and out. And we have to, you know, grate our cheeses here, and we have to make paste and bases for our, um, our you know, pastries and stuff. So He's helping us test the Magic Bullet's big claims. That does any job in 10 seconds or less. First, we went over the basics. This is the whipping blade. Okay. And I think that's the chopping blade. Okay. Then it was mixing time. Alberto had plenty of ideas laid out. We started with Parmesan cheese. Great cheese in just four seconds. But his cheese is the real deal, authentic and aged. Wow. It's really, really hard. We cut it up and threw it in. Ready, set, go. One, two, three. It didn't handle the job in four seconds. It actually took about ten, but the final product was good. I didn't, I didn't think that it will actually do it this fast. I thought it, I thought it was going to take longer, and the pieces are going to be bouncing around. Here at Granados, they make what's called a tapenade. It's basically a puree, and when they make it, they use this serious tool with some very serious power. We're going to try making the same tapenade, the same puree, with the magic bullet. No liquids. See, it's just, it's just the, the ingredients. So one, two, three. So that was three. Okay. That's pretty good. Again, it didn't nail it in three seconds, but it worked nonetheless. No complaints. It does the job. That's why I said before, it does right. the job. So it's not wimpy. <laughs> you heard him, not wimpy. He's impressed with the power. Now it's time for the smoothie, a blender staple. We're just going to put strawberries first. Throw in some ice, add some Reese's milk. Cream. It's blending time. Uh, okay, well, it works. <laughs> you know, it, it's a beautiful shake, I have to say. He said it, beautiful. Yeah, I can see that it's smooth. <laughs> it's a real smooth. <laughs> it's a real smooth E. <laughs> All jokes aside, we did end up finding a few ice chunks inside. Nothing a few more seconds on the magic bullet didn't fix. Bottom line, everything we whipped up looked and tasted great. But that's not that's not the blender. It's me, you know. So if you have the skills to throw together the right ingredients, Alberto says the magic bullet is a good tool to use. I I think it's great. I think it's, it it works good. It does the job. Um, I think it will make some killer guacamole, <laughs> but uh, and, and easy too. You know, it's convenient. It's small. And he says, for ninety bucks, you can replace a blender completely. If you have something like this. The Magic Bullet Platinum Pro is a good deal. Again, the unit that we tested is the newest model. It's called the Magic Bullet Platinum Pro. Now, the company tells us it's a bit stronger than the previous model. It sells for ninety dollars. More info on my blog at myfoxutah.com.